All right, guys, every time I cut a lock using my angle grinder, somebody says, use a die grinder, it's a lot faster. And you know what, today we're gonna find out. My neighbor, who owns every tool in the universe, just brought, bought a brand new Makita 18 volt uh, die grinder. It is 26,000 RPM. It's written on here somewhere, there we go. 26,000 RPM, I bought three boxes of metal cutting disc. All these are three inch designed just for metal cutting and they are I believe a sixteenth of an inch thick. There we go. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take this brand new die grinder which is probably fairly typical of the type of die grinder that criminals might use to cut like a bicycle or a motorcycle lock and we're gonna cut through each of these. Uh, I have a, a variety of different locks, all very popular, and then I've got a couple of change. I have a Peewig 12 millimeter and a Peewig 15 millimeter. Both of these are hardened chains. This one is designed for motorcycle or high security. This one is actually for a hoist, so all hardened steel. This one is slightly harder than that, but it doesn't matter. What, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut them without really saying a whole lot, and then I'm going to put the model number of the lock and the diameter of the shackle at the bottom of the frame, and at the end I'm going to put the time that it took to cut through the shackle using a high-speed die grinder. And then we're going to find out once and for all if this really is faster.
All right, guys, I think you can see that most of these locks and chains can be cut through with a die grinder in something less than 10 seconds. There were some variations, of course. The thicker the shackle, the better off you're going to be. Uh, the, and the type of shackle made a bit of difference, it appeared. The boron carbide and the one on this Medico seemed to take significantly longer or harder on the blade than, than the others. The others, despite being hardened, we went through those in seconds. So over there, anyway guys, there you go. That I hope that answers the question once and for all. Yes, the die grinder beats picking hands down. Thanks for your time, stay safe, and after this lesson, you better stay legal. Thanks guys.